I'm Madison Meyer. Here's a look at what's happening today. One person is dead after a shooting in Tahoe City. This happened yesterday afternoon at the Boatworks shopping mall. The scene was secured by around 615. Placer County detectives say a 33 year old man from Nevada was killed. They are calling this a double shooting, but haven't said anything about a second victim and no word yet on any arrests. A hot air balloon ride took a scary turn today. 10 people were on board this balloon when it made a crash landing on Skaggs Island near Vallejo. This happened around 10 o'clock this morning. Pilot called the incident an emergency landing after saying high winds were pushing that balloon towards power lines. No one was seriously injured. If you need some shoes, now is the time to do some shopping. Payless has confirmed all 2100 stores in the U.S. and Puerto Rico will close by May. Liquidation sales begin today, and the company is also closing its online operation. Payless closing is the biggest by a single chain this year and almost doubles the number of retail stores set to close next year. Now for a check of your weather, here's meteorologist Tracy Humphrey. Hey, thank you, Madison. I'm thinking maybe I should take a little ride by Payless. I could always use a few extra pair of shoes. Uh, here's a look at I-80 at Kingville. Here in Sacramento, we are bathing in sunshine, but they are still looking at some rough conditions up there. Uh, scattered snow showers will be in the forecast uh, and through about late this evening to early tonight. Here's a look at 50 and Myers, slow going still. The opportunity for those scattered snow showers remain in the forecast, so we do still have a winter storm warning until 7 o'clock tonight for the Lake Tahoe area. Again, I mentioned uh, but most of Sacramento area down through the valley looking at plenty of sunshine that came in for the latter portion of the afternoon. Temperatures in the lower 50s, so still trending about 10 degrees below average for this time of the year. Lower 20s currently in Tahoe, and this is being recorded around 4 o'clock in the afternoon. So here's a look at that satellite and radar. Just a few showers coming in through Fairfield just along the Delta. And again, the opportunity for those snow showers becoming uh, less in intensity as we move through tonight as this system kind of wraps up. But we are still seeing some decent bands of snow showers moving in through parts at the Sierra that's illustrated by that nice light blue to medium blue shading that you see there. Winter storm warning again in effect until seven o'clock tonight. Snow timeline additional six inches possible before it's all said and done. And then tomorrow is going to be a fairly decent day, but definitely a cold start to the day. Mostly clear conditions overnight tonight here in Sacramento with overnight lows just above freezing 33 degrees winds out of the north to northwest at five to 10 miles per hour for tomorrow is a holiday. Yeah, this is the type of day you want to sleep in, right? Take a look at this Bay Area. You'll see morning lows in the lower 40s, afternoon highs in the mid 50s, 31 for the valley, 54 for the afternoon high, 29 in the foothills. Picked up a little snowfall today, lower 50s for the foothills. And look at that zero for the morning low in the Sierra with an afternoon high of 28. But you can see no show, no snow showers in the forecast tomorrow. Plenty of sunshine is expected. So that's a look at your weather. And now you're all caught up with what's happening today.